stop is a place where you could come for the coffee, safe for the plants, but frequent for the connection. Take a look. Whether morning or afternoon, nothing soothes the soul quite like a cup of coffee. With some flowers on the side. Welcome to Maypop Coffee and Garden Shop. And the whole concept was, what about a place that serves coffee as kind of like the doormat? to plants. Made Pop Coffee and Garden Shop was founded in 2018 by three friends with two interests, coffee and gardening. Tammy, alongside Laura T and Laura C, opens the shop in an old historic home in Webster Groves. And the neighborhood hub quickly became a place of nourishment for the heart and the soil. Longtime customer Kim Sanders and her pup Kit frequent the shop three to four times a week. Well, the combination is simply amazing. I mean, where else can you go for a cup of coffee and some delicious pastries and then head over to the greenhouse and just enjoy everything that's there. And the people are just, that they're what make it. They're just delightful, wonderful people, super knowledgeable, super friendly. So I started my visit with a cup of joe. At Maypop, since day one, we have served Blueprint Coffee. Um, we really are dedicated to working with local folks and local brands, people who are thinking about the person behind the product. And coffee is not the only taste of local on the menu. Customers can shop Big Heart Tea, Sweet Art, Brit's Bakehouse, and Need Bakehouse's sourdough bread. And once your appetite is satisfied, you could stay for the plants. From your starter point um, with your ZZ plants or your snake plants to maybe more rare specimen type plants, and we like to carry a variety so that it can meet all folks at whatever level they are when it comes to wanting to tap into having plants in their home or if they want to kind of spice things up and extend their plant family. The garden shop offers all types of greenery for those with or without a green thumb. And if you are looking for a creative space, they offer a do-it-yourself terrarium. So really it's just a space for people to come in and be the artists that they are and create what speaks to them. Because after all, that is what makes this place so special. Whether you visit for the community. The center of a neighborhood where folks come with their pets and they go on walks, they stop by and get a coffee or they meet here and bring friends that don't live nearby or the creativity. Artists and creatives come here as a space for inspiration. Or perhaps alone time. This is definitely my favorite place in St. Louis to just come bring some, I, I like to crochet, so I'll bring a project with me, sit in the cafe and crochet. If I have a little pup with me, we'll sit outside and just enjoy the beautiful surroundings and some quiet time. May Pop Coffee and Garden Shop has the connection you are looking for. You know, I think people come here just as a space to like, Oh yeah, it's green in the middle of January and it's warm and I feel comfortable in here. And so it really has become a space for inclusivity. Like it's a space where people can come and feel seen and heard and find a tasty beverage, drink, be surrounded by nature and just, I think find a space to just be. I think we all need that. <laughs> 